Hello everyone, welcome back to Mass Mode. Here we have interesting exponential equation 4 to the power x plus 8 to the x over 4 to the x equal to 3. If you know an answer, if you an answer, write a suggestion in comments. So let's try to solve it. I want to suggest you a real quick two methods how to solve this. The first method and the second method. But let's let's try the first one. Okay, we have a situation like that, of course we can simplify this a little bit. We can write this on the left as 4 to the power x over 4 to the power x plus 8 to the power x over 4 to the power x equal to 3. Nothing change. Of course, if we add this once more, we'll have a situation like that. So nothing change. But it's a really good case for us. I'll show it later. Okay, simplifying this a little bit, it will be equal to 1 plus 8 to the power x over 4 to the x. We can write it in one parenthesis. 8 over 4 to the power x equal to 3. What are we going to do next? 8 over 4 equal to 2 to the power x equal to, bring this one on the right, equal to 2, and x of course equal to 1. And this is the first method, but I want to show you a real quick second method how to solve this. And this is our first method. This is our root. And I want to show you a real quick second method how to solve this. Of course, we can divide, you can multiply both sides by 4 to the power x. So let's do this method too. 4 to the power x times 8 to the power x equal to 3 times 4 to the power x. Nothing hard, just multiplying both sides by 4 to the x. What we're going to do next? Of course, bring this 3 times 4 to the power x on the left. So we'll have 4 to the power x plus 8 to the power x and minus 3 times 4 to the power x equal to 0. We have a really good case because we have 4 to the power x minus 3 times 4 to the power x. So this is something like x minus 3x. So as a result we will have 8 to the power x and of course minus 2 times 4 to the power x equal to 0. This is x, this is minus 3x, and of course it will be minus 2x, but in our case x is 4 to the power x. What we're going to do next? How can we simplify this? We can write this 8 as 2 times 4. 2 times 4 to the power x minus 2 times 4 to the power x equal to 0. But right here we have parentheses, it's not the same. If we have a situation like that, we raise 2 to the power x and 4 to the power x. So, 2 to the power x times 4 to the power x minus 2 times 4 to the power x equal to 0. 4 to the power x and 4 to the power x, we can factor out it as a common, so 4 to the power x, and in parentheses we will have 2 to the power x minus 2, right from here and from here, equal to 0. 4 to the power x equal to 0 does not have any roots, so we just write an equation with our second parentheses, 2 to the power x minus 2 equal to 0, and of course x equal to 1. The same result as right here. But this method is a little bit longer method, and of course there is a third method how to solve this, and this is the hardest, but if you're interested in logarithm, of course you can solve it. So method 3 is about logarithm. So if you're interested in this, write your answer in comment, write your suggestion in comment, and I think everyone, for everyone, it will be interesting to read, to, to, to see how this equation solve is logarithm. Thank you for watching, maybe you have any suggestion, maybe you have any question, and see you in the next videos.